YouTube, what's going on? Thanks again for joining me today for another Bleach Brave Souls video. Now, I really love the way the reson resonance has been going for this series. Like, I always like to show these old ass characters, like this, this Kugo is today's topic. And I really like to show these old characters what they are like if they are max transcended. Like, can they keep up with today's stuff? Can they keep up with today's quests and uh, game contents that we have? And uh, are they still fun to play with? Like, to be honest with you, I, I play with a lot of characters. I even play with Max Transcendent Frenzy units. They are fun. So if you haven't seen those videos already, go back to my channel. Check them out. Trust me, you will be thinking differently afterwards about these units. If you aren't one of those already. Now... Today, I'd like to talk about this mind, Kugo. Um, I've had him I've got him for ages, but I've just recently been able to max transcend him because I was missing one more copy of him. And now it's time for me to check him out to see what is he, what is he even got. Now, let's, let's see. Like, to be honest with you, I'm not going to lie. I like the design. This, the design looks nice. And yeah, that, that just says everything. He's a melee unit. So he's a bit awkward to play with to be honest with you but let's just see like as for his soul trait he has damage inflicted at low stamina plus 30 percent that is really useless to be honest with you and attack three recharge time minus 10 percent which is good now he is max transcendent he has the plus one sp at his extra slot he is an sp based unit so that is doing him well um he is t20 um, as for his accessories, I gave him the hunting cap, the fortification pill, and daddy's great whistle. That sounds kind of pervertish, but yeah. Um, character links, Max Transcendent Isane, level 10 as SP slot Shunsui, and Max Transcendent Chad. So yeah, he's getting a lot of bonus from that. He is at, yeah, he's at over 4,000 SP, so definitely hitting hard enough in regards to SP. Um, his skills, he hasn't really got all that much talking for him, to be honest with you. Now, increased normal attack, strong attack damage, yeah, um, plus 40%, devastation 40%, reduced strong attack cooldown, 48% based on the stamina, on the, on the transcendent links. Then full stamina damage boost, that is his bonus effect. 4015 low stamina damage boost 30 percent then i gave him stamina recovery long reach is built in already havoc 20 percent that he's got havoc is obviously that is the best thing going for him frenzy plus one which is good um increased stamina minus 30 percent yeah and these are all based off the accessories so overall he's not too bad i, I think when did he come out 2016 2016 i think or 2017 uh, I'm not even sure. No, he came 2017. He's from, yeah, I think so. Well, don't don't stole me on that. I don't know when he came up, but yeah, let's uh, let's forget about that. But uh, design-wise, to be honest with you, he looks nice. Like I'm not gonna lie, he has he has that evil touch for him. And yeah, let's let's just see how he performs. Like on 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 days on on content nowadays, he's human affiliation and he has Soul Reaper Killer. So let's see. So here we are at difficult quest PVE content. Now I have this time inheritance trials PVE left, so I will be trying him there. Um, let's see how he performs. It needs to be mind only. Let's see none of the resistance. So let's get let's get into this. Um, yeah, I won't be able to get any team bonus of these two but let's just use other ones do i have a mind ichigo at t10 no i don't okay so let's get kisuke in there let's get her in there so he's just getting at least a six star bonus um attack plus 15 stamina 25 that is making him viciously bad um but yeah let's take away the allies and yeah what are the enemies no affiliation so he is off killer bearing in mind he's so ripper killer so I'm not too sure how he's going to perform here. This is actually my first time testing, testing him, Max Transcendent, as he is on, uh, on a quest like this. So let's see how he, how he performs. So back again now. 
let's go. Oh, I love the way he's flying. Oh, the first strong attack. The sec the 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 first strong attack looks nice. It's the forward lunge, full screen. Ah, oh, the second one is so trash. That is so trash. I like his uh, second strong attack. I think that is basically his best move. I would I would even just say like that. Like that is nice. Like I love how these shock waves emit forward and just uh, kill waves behind and in front of him. But his damage is not that good. And yeah, but the good thing is I gave him stamina recovery. So bam, there he is again at full power. Destroying everything in his ways. Ginjo. To be honest with you, I, I liked him in the anime. Like, I think they uh, done him credits, of, of course. In the anime, he, he's, he's one of the nicer characters to see, to be honest with you. Even though the other Ginjo, the power Ginjo in this game, looks like the character from Greece. Um, if you know what I'm talking about, it's a movie. Um, yeah, with John Travolta, and he looks exactly like him. I'm not even gonna lie. I don't even know if Caleb was either looking at him, making him look like him, or was looking at the anime. But yeah, that's another story. Now, as you can see, he isn't performing too bad. He's doing all right, but his damage is a bit low. Like I'm not gonna lie. Like even, um, even Frenzy Max Transcendent Eisen on my other video does more damage than him to be honest with you but still like he's going through them like it's nothing and this is as hard as it gets really like for for pve content like inheritance trials is the bread and butter uh at the moment so yeah considering how old he is he's max transcendent and he's resurrected so think about him without his max uh, without his resurrection he would be even worse but with resurrection he's playable like uh he's 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 doing all right. He's, he can hold himself. Let's say it like that. Will he be able to auto this content? I don't think so. But is he able to complete it like this? Definitely. So, is not string. Oh, oh. Four is going to die then. Now, is not string is... Uh, let's see. Tack, tack, tack. Yeah, it's not really of worth mentioning bearing in mind he's an sp unit so nad is not really his uh his usual attack patterns but yeah first first strong attack second strong attack again he destroyed them i'm eager to see how his um soul bomb is like if he'd be able to clear the whole room and there is oh, i like how the way that looks like considering how old that character is that Strong attack looks nice. Like, I'm not gonna lie, that is looking sick. And he cleared it, he destroyed it like he absolutely destroyed the room without taking significant damage. Um, stamina recovery and strong attack damage boost does him well, to be honest with you. Like, that did him definitely very good. Um, for the way he is now, he's like I said, he's resurrected, he gained uh, the strong attack recharge time minus 10% with his resurrection before that he was just absolutely trash with damage inflicted at low stamina um but yeah i remember back in the days people used him used to use him quite a lot in brave battles um i could see him being useful there at some stage back in the days but nowadays with the current characters with the current meta he's not really up there anymore like um but you could build him like for a fun build you could for example go and like i don't know full defense or full full stamina build and just see how it performs against some teams but pvp that's a whole another topic man that's like you gotta understand more things of the game and not just throw in any unit there but as for fun i might even make a video in the future again of him i'm just seeing how he does there um like with a fun kind of team uh thrown together but yeah that's that's for another day as for now that concludes our videos guys thanks for joining again um i'd appreciate if you haven't done that already leave a follow um you know subscribing is free it doesn't cost you nothing and yeah at the end of the day if you don't like my content you can always unsubscribe leave your comment down below how you think um this character is how you um how you like my videos up till now 
if you have any suggestions on what kind of videos i should be making in the future let me know down below in the comments and yeah apart from finishing the video now i wish you all a nice day